Good morning again, parents. The subject of this video is going to be our kits that the students will be getting for their supplies. Um, to begin with, my nurse want to make sure we knew our nurse is Teresa Thompson, and her email address is T T H O M P S O N at Lead L E A D Academy A C A D E M Y A L dot org. Once again, that is our nurse Teresa Thompson. And if you have, if your student has a medical issue or they take medication or they have asthma and it may not be, if it hasn't been reported to us, um, if you want to make sure of that, you can drop her an email or give her a call here at Lead Academy to make sure that she knows all the medical issues or health concerns that you may have with uh, taking medications here at the school. Once again, our nurse is Teresa Thompson, T. Thompson at Lead Academy AL. Dot org. Um, let's get into our school supplies. I know parents have asked several questions about uh, how our supplies are going to look uh, the first day when they get in. What's their student going to see? Um, first, if you will take an envelope and put your name on it and write the grade number on it and then put your $25 in this envelope so that when your student comes to class the first day, just tell them to hand this to their teacher once they get in class so they will pay for these supplies. It's just $25. Now I'm fixing to show you an example of a kit that we have. <clears throat> this is a kindergarten kit. Okay, When your student comes into class, there will be a box just like this. It's not a very big box, but it will have all their supplies inside the box. Um, when you open the box, this is a kindergarten kit, so every other grade will have a different kit on the inside. But these are the things that you would expect to find in a kindergarten kit. Uh, the first thing is a primary source journal. And if you look at it, it's got the pages on the inside so that students can draw a picture and then tell a story about it below. This is a, a journal book for kindergarten. They get a box of crayons, 24 count. Eight count box of markers. They have colored pencils. They'll get uh, these are 12 count colored pencils. They get a, a nice container box to put everything in. Two packs of pencils. Two packs of notebook paper. A pair of scissors. A three ring binder, we have one, two, three, four, five different folders. These will be used in class and they get four glue sticks and this is all the supplies that they're going to get and they'll be in the box on day one. So when your student comes to school, they give their teacher their supply money and they will have the supplies already on their desk. Um, I understand if you can't pay the $25 day one, so we're going to go ahead and have the student supplies so that they can use them day one. Just please, if you can, make sure that you get us the money uh, sometime next week uh, in an envelope to our teachers so that I can receive it, because what I'm going to do is just take the number of the, the, the name of the student and the grade, and I'm going to build a receipt, and I'm going to return the receipts back to the teachers. Um, it might help if you would put the teacher's name on the bottom so I know what class they're in. It'd be easier for me to get the receipts to them when I start receiving. Uh, but this is all the supplies that's going to come in the kindergarten box. I think we got we did a pretty good deal of getting these these things for $25 and after all when you buy through the school it's tax free. Um, so these supplies will be in a box. They'll be waiting on your student on day one and they'll come in, open the box, and they'll be able to do whatever they need to do. Uh, all the other supplies will be brought from the teacher. Um, they had fee money and they bought supplies and things. And a lot of our books we already can write in. So this is all the things that they get for the $25. Um, and that is the end of this video uh, for today. Thank you.